we keep our thumb up and it goes up and down. When they were born, we thought that there was nothing wrong with them. And when you look at five-year-old twins Elizabeth and Catherine Gertler play with their big brother Leroy, you'd never suspect they were born with a deadly disease. I was so little. I was still little. Hours after birth, doctors told parents Michelle and Brett that standard newborn screening blood tests revealed their precious baby twins had something wrong with their blood, a condition that could develop into leukemia if not treated, a megakaracidic thrombocytopenia. It was devastating, actually. Mayo Clinic pediatric hematologist Dr. Shaquilla Khan says it's an inherited disease that causes your bone marrow to malfunction and not make enough platelets, which are the components of blood responsible for clotting. The curative treatment is bone marrow transplant for these patients. For their first four years, the girls stayed relatively healthy with transfusions of platelets. But as the disease progressed, the Gertlers decided it was time for a transplant. First, it was Elizabeth's turn, and then Catherine's. Dr. Khan and a medical team that included Dr. Vilmarie Rodriguez and nurse practitioner Julia Gord prepared the girls for the procedure. It involves wiping out the bone marrow and immune system with chemotherapy and sometimes radiation. Then healthy donor stem cells are infused into the bloodstream via an IV. As if equipped with a homing device, the new cells travel to the bone marrow where new healthy cells grow. It wasn't an easy journey. The girl spent lots of time in the hospital. It was very hard. But the bone marrow transplants were successful. That they can now just be normal little kids again. That's what I want for them. Healthy and strong and able to keep up with their big brother, Leroy. For Mayo Clinic News Network, I'm Vivian Williams.